What's good, YouTube? Man, it's your boy Truly Key back again with another video, man. I hope y'all boys doing great, man. But in today's video, I've been straight cooking on 2K, bro. I have to show you all the best jewel moves for season two this year, man. I am cooking like crazy. I'm not gonna lie, I lost motivation on this game for a bit, but after I made this new build and I got these dribble moves, man, I've been having fun on this game, bro. I've been playing every game mode with this build and these new dribble animations. I've been playing pro Am everything like but these dribble moves really gonna have you straight cooking bro i'm doing things i didn't even know i could do i finally actually took my time and studied the dribble moves and really realized how i wanted to play and everybody else play style like some guards they hide behind screens some iso i got the dribble moves for everything like all these dribble moves we can do all that in one drop a comment how y'all feel about season two and then we're setting our records man let me know if y'all like that or y'all don't personally i ain't gonna lie i like this my record before was kind of it was kind of bad i'm not gonna lie I had to, you know, get used to the game, adjust to the game. But now I'm adjusted, man. Y'all about to get the greatest content ever. For the ones that support me, man, I'm going to feature y'all boys in my next video, man. For the ones that really support me, like my man's Jay, like I say all the time, man. He's a W, man. He's really a W. Now, if you a W like him, you're going to be featured in every video or every other video. You know what I'm saying? Just look at this, though. Look where I'm pulling from. Oh, my God. Let me know in the comments down below if y'all really want the jump shot, man. But that's enough yapping. Let's get into these dribble moves, which y'all came for. Now, for the dribble style, man, this is right here is personal preference it's very optional i'm gonna show you what you can do with both of these dribble styles that's why here is the most used dribble style in the game magic johnson people love this because of one move bro i bet you played against this move before bro and it's so annoying bro like i'm gonna show you exactly what i mean bro they literally spam that move over and over this move right here bro i know y'all get hit with this move every game y'all play bro i'm so tired of that move if you want to be one of them people and use that move too bro that's all you need that's the only move you need right there magic johnson dribble style that's all you need bro I came to show y'all boys what I use. This is what I use, Gabby Williams. This is the best one in my opinion. Now, like I said before, it's really personal preference on how you want to get open and your play style. But I use this one because I like fading. And I can just run off of speed boost. Like, I don't really have to do too much. I personally say use this one. This is the best one in my opinion. But you can use the other two. Zach Levine or Magic Johnson. That's the only two for real. Well, that's the only other two good ones. Like, the rest of them mid. I'm not going to lie. Now, this signature size up is De'Aaron Fox, man. This one is great, bro. This is the best one to use for our tall guards. If you 6'8", 6'9", whatever you is, this one. Put, use this one right here. Trust me. Ain't gonna lie. Ever since they added this one in 23, bro, this is the one I've been going with in every 2K since 23. Well, it's only been one of the 2K, so not every 2K, but you know what I mean. Now, remember, this is what I use. What I use, not what everybody else uses. This is what I use. So, but I really don't think there's no other good one. Like, for tall guards, the rest of them really trash for real. Like, you can't even combo. You can't do nothing out of them for real. So, I say use this one. If you want to dribble like me and you want to, you know what I'm saying, use this one. Now, for the regular breakdown combo, bro, I don't use these at all. If anybody tell you they're using these in the game, bro, they lying, bro. Nobody uses these. I don't ever do a size up. But if I do, this is the best one I do. I ain't gonna lie. This one gets you open a little bit if you use it. But most of the time, you're not doing no size up, bro. Trust me. And then you may mistakenly do it. So if you mistakenly do it, this is the one to do. Like I just told y'all before, people don't really do size ups. But this size up, I'm not going to lie. This size up is nice, bro. If you know how to do that glitchy John Morant flip thing, I don't know how to do that for real. But if you know how to do that, this is what they used to do it. This John Morant aggressive breakdown combo right here. If you want to learn how to do that, go search up a video how to do that. And But this is the move you need to do that. Now for escape moves, man, this right here, this right here, man, this is my favorite move in the game, man. I'm going to show y'all some clips. On how I be getting so open with this move right here, bro. All right, look at this, man. And you also can combo with this Kimball move like crazy, bro. Y'all see how I'm, like, look how I'm moving. Look how I'm moving, bro. Like, I love that move right there. If you learn how to do the L2 cancel with this Kimba escape, bro, you're going to be unguardable. Trust me, bro. Like, I'm already cooking with it without even knowing how to do that. But I'm saying, but when you one of them smaller guards, like you 6'6", six, six, man, and escape moves, you got so many options. You got three options. But you, this the main two right here. Kimba and Trey, the main two. I don't really use Trey Young. Like, I'm just showing y'all what, what I use now. Like, just my updated six, but I used it before. I'm telling you, it's like that. You just you should try it. Now, when you're on a taller guard that's taller than 6'6, six, six, man, Jimmy Butler is the move, man. You have to go with Jimmy Butler because that's really the only option you got, game. Now, for combo moves, man, like I said before, bro, I do this move sometimes, only a little bit. This move is another size up, bro. Nobody does size ups. But I'm telling you, I do this move sometimes. Like, if you're a bot, you're going to do this move majority of the time. But I do this move sometimes. It don't really get me nowhere for real. It's literally just a standstill size up. That's all it is. Now, for the crossover, the crossover, man, this right here is 
my second favorite move in the game, bro. I know I said Kimba really, but I ain't gonna lie. This might take first place, bro. I use this move majority of 90% of the time I play the game. I'm not gonna lie. This helps me get open all of the time, bro. I'm gonna show you so many clips. The only negative with this crossover, if you do this crossover into somebody's body, you're losing the ball 90% of the time. So it's kind of risky, but it's so effective. I'm gonna show you what I mean. When they give you that little lane, bro, so you can split the defense with this crossover every time, bro, and just get wide open. This crossover is so crazy. I'm not going to lie, I do this move so much as muscle memory. Like, I, I literally just have it, like, in my head, like, to where I just have to do it. That De'Aaron Fox crossover, bro, it probably creates the most space in the game besides the behind the back of Jamal Murray, bro. It opened 90% of the time doing that crossover. Now, for the behind the back, man, now, this right here, man, this is right here is my third favorite move in the game i love this move so much i'm glad they added this to 2k bro this move is great bro this creates so much space if you learn how to l2 cancel out this move bro you're gonna be moving devious i'm gonna show you exactly what i mean this move right here is perfect for the ones court man if you l2 cancel out of it like that bro it's amazing i'll drop a hundred likes on this video man if y'all want to learn how to l2 cancel i'll show you exactly how to do it but i need this video to get a hundred likes man i know we can reach a hundred man we do it almost every single time now can we get this video to 100 likes bro and i got y'all with the l2 cancel tutorial bro trust for the next dribble move which is spin bro i probably can count on my hands how many times i did a spin move in this game you would never do a spin move in this game it's so rare but if you're gonna do a spin move in this game Use Kawhi because he got this little glitchy little spin, bro. It's like right there. Yeah, that one right there. That one perfect, bro. Use Kawhi spin, bro. Trust me. It is rare that you're going to do a spin, though, bro. Now, for the next move is hesitations, man. I am still playing with the hesitations, man. But as of right now, John Wall been looking nice, bro. I be getting open with this a lot, bro. So, y'all should use John Wall. But if y'all got any other suggestions, bro, just let me know in the comments below. I might try it out. So, right now, for the new season, for the 6-6 six, six scars, man, this right here is what I'm using. So, if you want to use what I'm using, just go for it. And John Wall, the best in my opinion. Now, for the step back, man, this right here, this move right here, man, you need this move in your bag. Like, if you ain't got this move in your bag, bro, what are you doing, bro? This right here is the best move in the game to me. To me. I know I said that about a lot of things, but I'm not going to lie. This might be the best move in the game. Only reason I say this might be the best move in the game, because you get that snatch back animation and you get that pullback animation. This is what I mean when I show you the pullback. It's going to do right, right there. That's what I mean. That animation and that animation is the two best moves for a lot of options here, bro. But choose John Wall. Do that John Wall move so much. It's crazy. Like, look at this snatch. Oh, my God, man. That move right there is so crazy, bro. Equip it, bro. Hey, man, that's all for today's video, man. We're going to wrap it up here, man. Let me know how I did on the video. Like I said before, man, this is my fourth YouTube video. I think I'm doing pretty good, man. Let me know in the comments how I'm doing, man. Drop a sub as well. Appreciate it. We on the road to 1K. I need a 1,000 subscribers, bro. Y'all give me a 1,000 subscribers, bro. Stand with me, bro. To be W supporters, bro. I'm going to keep bringing y'all great content, bro. So drop a sub, man. Turn on post notes. And drop a like. And comment down below if, if this was a W YouTube video. Now y'all want more. And I'm going to see y'all soon, man. I'm out.